In tonight's Healthier Me, it's that time of year. Millions of us will be cooling off in pools and oceans and lakes, and that means a higher risk for swimmer's ear. Swimmer's ear can start out with mild symptoms, but quickly escalate to pain, itching, redness, and drainage. Unlike an infection of the middle ear, Dr. Liebert says swimmer's ear happens when bacteria grows in the ear canal. When water gets in here and either gets stuck around wax or just irritates the ear canal, the ear canal swells uh, and that's when you start to get some small cracks in the tissue that serves as a harbor for infection, which is what leads to outer ear infections or swimmer's ear. Over-the-counter swimmer's ear drops can help treat the infection by acidifying the ear and killing the bacteria. But in some cases, Dr. Liebert says prescription ear drops are needed. Later in sports, Red Hawks back in town. Beth has highlights from the series opener against Sioux Falls. But first, are you in the market for a new smartphone? What could work best for you and your family? Coming up next.